you just twist it and play it around. I kind of moved everything around so it was new for her again. Yes, you baby. Um, I bought her a wheel. She climbed into it, but she hasn't actually claim it, played in it yet. She was um, kind of like making it run on the outside for a while. But she hasn't actually ran while in it. She's gone in it and turned around once it started moving a little bit on her. But we'll see. Um, yeah, so here's the cage setup. I uh, I moved a few things around just so things were new and exciting for her. I, uh, I bought a candle, so I gave her the old box because when I took it apart, she was cuddling inside of it. So I thought she might like it. She likes to be enclosed when she's sleeping. Um, this is her water fountain. Uh, she manages to drink that in like two days or spill it. I'm not really sure which. Um, her food, that's actually uh, old bread. You can see it here. It's, um, it's all hard and crusty, so it doesn't get stuck in her mouth. Um, I used to keep this pillowcase covering her cage, but she'd end up pulling it through so she'd have a blanket to cuddle with. So now I just leave it there so she has something to do during the day, pull it all through. Um, I bought this bird ladder, and I had it on the inside so that she'd have to climb the ladder to get at her salt lick, because there's um, sandpaper on this to wear down her claws. But uh, she likes it here so she can get over here without having to go up through the hole. Um, this is the equivalent of a McDonald's playpen to her, and I'm not really sure why. All it is is, um, well, there's this box that she just climbs on. And down here is like a, a laundry basket, well, a little tiny one. It's got mesh in it so you can see in, but there's holes so she can actually get inside of it and climb on top. So she spends countless hours doing this when I'm on the computer. I just let her play here. And uh, it's impossible to get her back out because you can't really reach your hand down there. So you have to coax her out. But uh, she can climb in and out through here, no problem. And uh, I wash that out about once a week because she does make a mess in there sometimes. Um, yeah, so this is her home. I, uh, I think I'm doing pretty good. You know, as far as first time rat owner, not really sure what I'm up to, but she seems to be doing just fine. See, there she's, um, she's actually inside that box there. You can't quite tell, but she's actually in there. Alright, well, that's it for this ratty vlog. Alright, bye.